everyone this is mahali from cyber panel and in today's video we will be talking about uh, how to serve static assets with an efficient cash flow policy now when static assets are served with an efficient cash flow policy the user's browser will store these files locally and less time will be needed to load the page again now as soon as the page is loaded all of its all of the resources of the page for example the css the html the javascript the images they must be downloaded now browser caching basically allows the browser to retrieve static assets like css javascript and images from its local cache so as a result the pages load more quickly uh, the cache content means subsequent visits to a page will be faster than the first visit that you do but not on the first visit not as fast as the first visit so in this video we will see how you can um, basically serve static asset with an efficient cache policy so without further ado let's just jump straight to the video Okay guys so now we are going to see how we can serve static assets with an efficient cache policy now we are going to do this using lightspeed cache plugin and using w3 total cache plugin so uh, before uh, we see how we can serve static assets we need to have both cache plugins installed and activated so that you will see lightspeed cache over here for lightspeed cache plugin and performance tab over here For W three total cache. Now, first of all, let's see how we can serve static assets using Lightspeed cache. So, simply uh, go into Lightspeed cache and click on cache. From here, click on the browser tab, and your browser cache toggle should be on. It shouldn't be off. It should be on. Once it is on, click on Save Change. so it's so simple our options are save it's so simple to save static assets using lightspeed cache next we are going to see how we can do the same using the w3 total cache now when you install and activate it you will see the performance tab over here go into it and click on browser cache now from here you have a lot of options a lot of options uh, for your caching but for this purpose for serving static assets scroll down into the media and other files now over here where it says expires header lifetime select this and give it 1555200 seconds which basically translates to 180 days now once that is done scroll down click on save all settings make sure when you do that to click on save settings and purge cache also <clears throat> so once that is all done we have successfully served st uh, static assets with an efficient cache policy using lightspeed cache plugin and w3 total cache plugin so that's it for today if you still have any questions just drop a comment in the comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe cyberpan